Most acute low back pain cases are diagnosed as nonspecific, meaning the healthcare provider doesn't know what causes it. As a patient, this may seem frustrating to you, but keep in mind that treatment, and in many cases simply waiting it out, can be instrumental in pain relief. Unless your practitioner picks up on signs of a complicated health condition, called red flags, diagnostic imaging tests are generally not necessary. If the pain persists despite treatment, at that point, such tests may be helpful. Sadly, even though clinical guidelines recommend only judicious use of imaging tests for back pain diagnosis, many healthcare providers routinely overuse them, even in mild cases of acute low back pain. In a 2009 article entitled Overtreating Chronic Back Pain, Time to Back Off? which was published in the Journal of the American Board of Family Medicine, Dr. Rick Deo, et. al. comment that the use of lumbar magnetic resonance imaging, MRI, increased in the Medicare population by 307% in the 12-year period from 1994 to 2006. The researchers add that up to two-thirds of these tests may have been inappropriately given. Sources of acute low back pain may include disc problems, vertebral fractures, muscle strain, and or ligament sprain.